So Mark Selby made 107 first frame. Frame two. Up on second to break. Always oh, Stuart Bingham might put it first poke. And Bingham, by the way, has avoided all the carnage because he's beaten Martin O'Donnell 4-1. So, of course, he won this title two years ago, Bingham. He's safely through to tonight's last 16. Barry Hawkins has just been beaten as well. 4-2 by Michael Giorgio, the shootout champion. So it's another top seed heading home. Robertson's 3-2 down now to Paul Davison. Excellent safety shot there by Nopon. Open the reds up, we've got a very good white. So I can get through the gap of the yellow and the brown. To get back, so not quite as good as I originally thought. Give Mark a path back to Bulk. So, Robinson St. Carm, the world number 29, pots his first ball. 26 years of age, first uh, to professional in 2010. Got to the semi finals here last year, so something about Cardiff he obviously likes. Big Judd Trump, amongst others, Karen Wilson as well. This season he got to the semi-finals of the Nine. World Open. He beat Selby in that tournament, as Neil Folds mentioned at the start. Eventually lost to Mark Williams, having been in front in the semi-final. He's had a pretty solid season. Up on, he's a he's a very good, very heavy scorer. I think that's his strength. You know, some of the matches he's played, he's one visit, every frame he's won, and uh, you know that's what he does. So you know, with the balls looking like this, he'd be, be really looking to score a big break here and follow what Mark did in the first frame. Seventeen. A little bit short there on the black. Come back a few more inches. May have to play a cannon onto the red near the black cushion. Depends on the angle he's got. His hand is yeah, it's not ideal. This. And we could hold it for the red there. So more of a tricky pot than he would have liked. 
Thirty-three. Thirty-three. Scoring has improved this season. He's made twenty-two centuries this season. He made fourteen the whole of last season. And obviously, there's a lot of snooker still to be played in the next couple of months so just suggests a, an all round improvement it's like contrasting style to Thailand's other top player Tep Chara Nu who's the fastest player on the circuit Yeah, it just shows you, doesn't it? It couldn't, couldn't really be more different. 40. Not one in Tip Chaya, but, and the, but they're both very heavy scorers. It's the strength of their game. And, you know, two really, really good players. So Tip Chaya is, you know, a lot more natural, much, much quicker, and Not one's a little bit more deliberate, a little bit more technical. But it doesn't really matter how you do it. As long as, uh, you know, the balls go in the pocket and you're winning matches, that's all that matters. Well, as you can see, this is the sixth black coming up. Robertson made a maximum Tuesday night and he's in line for 17,000 but obviously if anyone else makes one then it gets shared Forty-nine. it's a really nice to be honest I know the bit on the side cushion is a little bit awkward but, but the others are in pretty good positions I'm not sure how much of a focus on at the moment because it hasn't won the frame. But um, see, it's a pretty decent chance. But I'll, I, at the moment, it just be concentrating on getting enough to win the frame and we'll start thinking about maximums, especially against people like Mark Selby because you take your off it and then he ends up clearing up. You you end up losing the frame. Shorter pace there. Just left himself a little bit hampered on the back. And he would have liked. Should still be okay though. 67.
well, not necessarily clean, but it's gone in. He's still going. Now this... Uh, 72. ...is effectively for the frame. So then he can give the maximum visual attention. 73. You couldn't really have these four beds in the middle of the table any better, to be honest. I mean, anything to support this game. But uh, you might already be thinking about that bed on the side cushion. That's, you know, that's obviously the stumbling block at the moment. You just have to keep focused because you've got to make sure you get high on every, every bed. Oh, interesting. 81. I'm not sure about that one, I've got to be honest. be hard not to do anything but leave the white on the cushion there. Yeah, big pressure now on this black. He's got the red into play, but he's got to pot this to continue. And he's done it really well. Now, this is a serious chance now. Eighty-eight. That was a really good pot. He's hit that so well. That was a tough pot. I, I did say you should have got the red off the cushion, so. Now it's about nerve, really, isn't it? There's always been drama around Thai players making maximums. James Watton, our famously made one the day his father was shot, killed in Thailand. Tepchara knew twice missed the last black before finally making one. Tournament play. <coughs> Senkam's highest tournament break, 144. Last season, Scottish Open. 96. 97. Neil Robertson trailing to Paul Davison. His day could get worse if he loses that match and then half of his maximum prize is gone. <laughs> Crowd willing him on. These are Wonderful. special moments for Op and Senkam. Got to make sure he gets high on this red, unless he plays for it in the middle. But I think yeah, he's going around there. Have a look. Just make sure you're high. Don't finish low because you you have to start playing it with side, and it'd be difficult to get back on the black. That's why he may play for it in the middle. He's more more room, more of an area to get position so he can stay on the black. Whereas normally he'd play for it in the corner pocket, but. Pretty good. So we'll a little feeling he had a little bit more area to play with there, so he could uh, it'd be it'd be a lot easier to stay on the black. He's gone a tiny bit too far, but he's still pretty good on this red. Well, Neil Robertson has actually stopped playing on his table. He's watching with the, his opponent Paul Davison and the referee to see what happens here. <laughs> still going in the table in between Higgins and Stedman. I don't think they're aware of what's happening. But Neil Robertson spotted it. Now then, this is a big shot as well. He looks cool at the moment. Six colours to go. 120. The blue, pink are lovely because you can get on straight on the blue. You can just hold the blue where it is. 
perfect angle on the pink to come down where sometimes the pink's in a tricky little position. 122. We've had 148 official 147 breaks. Steve Davis made the first in 1982. Wolf Robertson the most recent just this week. Well, now Higgins and Stedman have stopped, so everyone stopped to give this man the best possible chance. Four balls to go. 129. Really brilliant break it's been. Hardly been out of position at all. Stop the white roughly where the blue is. Perfect angle on the pink. 130. See Selby in the background watching on the monitor. He made the 100th maximum the UK Championship a few years ago. He's been so carefully compiled this. And he stood over the last black. It's been a great break. He's, he's, like I said, he's, he's barely had any, any problems throughout the break. He's been in, been in perfect position, even enough all the time. See all the players standing in the background. And in goes the black. That is terrific from Noppen Senkan. A magnificent maximum. He looked so cool throughout the whole break. He really did. And he'll take a share of Neil Robertson's 17,000, providing, of course, no one else makes one. Brilliant stuff. He levels up at one apiece.